The town of Sunderland is gearing up for its town meeting moment this year, and like most other communities, it will have a different look in 2021. Instead of the regular informational floor meeting the night before the official town meeting day, which this year falls on Tuesday, March 2nd, town officials will host an online information meeting via Zoom. That meeting will be held Monday, February 22nd, and will start at 7 p.m. Outwardly, it looks like most of the warned articles in the town budget represent continuity with the past. A steady-as-she-goes approach, with no major new initiatives, has been adopted to ride out the COVID-19 pandemic. John French, the chairman of Sunderland Select Board, brings us up to speed. Not a whole, not a whole lot changed. Um, the the cemetery budget went up. It was at fifteen thousand last year. It's up to eighteen thousand eight hundred and fifty, and that's for the cemetery maintenance. Uh, yeah, gets a little more expensive each year for the upkeep. The general fund budget actually went down a little bit, twenty, uh, a little over twenty five hundred and fifty dollars. That's down, and the uh, highway fund budget went up fifteen thousand two hundred. So and not a whole lot of change, no big changes. There was um, most of that change came in payroll, of course, goes up a little bit. Um, retirement, just a very little bit, and that goes right along with the uh, salaries. And the other area that it went up just to, uh, to make the biggest part of the difference is we added um, sublet services went up instead of taking some of the things out of uh, uh, special projects funds for some of the smaller things we put those into uh, sublet services like some tree removal things like that to make it easier so that's that's where the big changes in that came from everything else was pretty much the same so that means, I guess, the tax rate staying basically about the same uh, it, on the municipal side? Uh, pretty much the uh, same. We actually, the uh, tax rate went down a little bit for the general fund and highway fund. Um, yeah, the highway fund really didn't change much at all. The general fund went down a penny on the dollar, and the others uh, – went up a you know municipal building debt cemetery fund and local agreement amount went up just a fraction of a penny and what i've asked is for people if you have questions to email the select board with them if you for some reason can't make the uh, zoom meeting on monday uh, those questions will be answered they'll be in the minutes this will be taped um, so that people will it'll be on gnat afterwards so if people want to see it you know can't make it monday they'll have access to it and be able to see it before um the ballots have to be in they went out last week uh, i know that i received mine on uh the 15th or the 16th i received my ballot so everybody uh if you haven't received your ballot by now you should but they need to be in by the close of the polls, which is 7 p.m. on March 2nd, 2021. Again, Sunderland's information meeting will be held Monday, February 22nd at 7 p.m. via Zoom. And login information is available on the town's website at sunderlandvt.org. If you missed the meeting, it will be available for viewing during the week between the information meeting and Tuesday, March 2nd, when the ballots will be tallied. Voting will take place at the Sunderland Town Hall, or the ballots, which have been mailed out to the town's residents, can be dropped off before then at the Town Hall or mailed in. For the GNAT-TV News Project, I'm Andrew McKeever.